Welcome back to another episode of Learn About Port Wine. This is going to be a brief review of the restaurant that's located at the Graham's Lodge in Gaia. Uh, the restaurant is Venom. Our almost perfect, less than perfect, could have been perfect experience. <laughs> So earlier this year, uh, late January, was my birthday, and my wife asked me what I wanted to do that day, and I said I want a really nice meal, and then maybe drink some port wine. So we decided to do the tasting, uh, the tour and tasting at the Graham's Lodge in Gaia, and to have lunch at the restaurant that is located there, the Venom restaurant. Very nice, definitely upper scale restaurant, um, great cuisine, beautiful place, beautiful location. So with the, the menu, we had the option to, you know, add the wine pairing, or I had, because my wife was ordering a la carte, I was ordering um, one of the set menus. Of course, I did opt for the menu that included the wine pairing. So each of the several courses was paired with a specific wine. Um, some of these were port wines, some were table wines, and they were really across the, uh, the, the portfolio of the, the Graham's offerings. So each wine really did go very well with what we were having, whether it was, um, I think we started with an amuse-bouche and then on to, I think a seafood entree and uh, I probably should have looked at the menu before doing this, but here's some pictures. It was, it was a really nice experience. Uh, service was exceptional. Food was very good. Um, Food was absolutely delicious. Um, my wife enjoyed her vegetarian entrees. It was, it was a great meal. It really was very enjoyable. I've mentioned before in these videos that I kind of feel like guilty not giving every place like a perfect review because um, a lot of these places I at least casually know some of the people who work there or I've seen them in other wine events or, you know, I, it's a small town and I, I see them a lot at different events and things. So, um, so if the food was good and the service was good and the ambiance was good, um, why wasn't it perfect? So when the bill was presented to us, um, the woman who was taking care of us came over and informed me that, uh, I believe she said, as you know, in Portugal, service is not included on the bill. And I thought that was interesting because I know for a matter of fact, it is. When you are at a restaurant in Portugal and you ask for the, the bill, um, the number at the bottom is the number that you were expected to pay. Tipping is very different here. It is, it is completely voluntary. It is not expected at all. My meal was the set menu with the wine pairing and my wife's a la carte uh, food and wine choices. So our bill came to 150 euros. It's actually pretty hard <laughs> to spend 150 euros for lunch in Porto. Um, now, it was worth every penny, and I would absolutely do it again. And before I get slammed in the comments about, if you can't afford to tip, you shouldn't go out to eat, to be presented with that in a very forward way, I, I did leave a, a 20 euro gratuity, um, which I, I was happy to do, but, and another reason that it didn't sit well for me is that I'm curious if they say the same thing to their Portuguese customers, and I don't think they do. 
Um, and I understand it. Look, everyone is out just trying to take care of things and, you know, uh, you know, paying the bills and putting bread on the table. But um, I, I just haven't been in a situation in the three years we've been here where I've been told that the, the check does not include service. Just to note, tipping in Portugal is voluntary. It is very appreciated when it's done, but it is not expected or mandatory. In another situation, I, I probably would have said something, but I, it would have been such a great meal, um, such a great experience for both of us. It was a beautiful day. I was, you know, full and happy and... <laughs> So, uh, yeah. So when you come to Porto, feel free to tip as much as you like or as little as you like, or you can consider me the cheapest person on the planet. Um, I would agree with that, except for the fact that you haven't met my brother. To sum it up, the Venom restaurant was a wonderful experience. I really appreciated the fact that we were able to offer a that we were able to choose a special menu with a wine pairing at lunch that wasn't requirement of all of everyone at the table. All in all, a great experience. It could have been a perfect experience, but it was, cl it was close to perfect. So let me know your thoughts if you have any questions or if you want to bitch at me for being a cheap tipper. <laughs> you can feel free to do that as well. So if you haven't, uh, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification button, and uh, join me next time for the next episode of Learn About Port Wine.